I have not washed my hands after going to the bathroom twice this morning. Tanya Hennessy and welcome to Recipe for Disaster. <laughs> That's not bad. This show is for anybody who has to cook. You don't want to cook. You have no interest in cooking, but you have to cook because otherwise you will die and you will kill others in the process. Now this segment is called, it's a bit wordy, my professional chef of a boyfriend might leave me unless I learn to cook something. Anyway, I'm making gnocchi carbonara. If you have lied to somebody on the internet and said you're a good chef, try this. So we're gonna start with 500 Desiree potatoes. Life. Oh life, oh life. Remember Desiree? No one does. What's she doing now? Okay, so you get these potatoes, right? Am I allowed to eat, lick it and then touch it again? I guess it's, who minds if I, I should wash my hands actually. I need a tea towel, but why use a tea towel when your dress looks like one? Okay, so we're gonna take the skin off these Desiree potatoes and then we are going to use flour, <laughs> I forgot what it was called, olive oil. I love the way we can put a man on the moon but we can't figure out how to get the skin off a potato. Oh, for the hell, why does this take so long? Bloody hell, this is quite hard, you know. I'm hungry, to be honest with you. I feel like this is gonna take way longer. Oh, what we're going, Kurt. Just a quick one, I reckon go to the gym before you start to make gnocchi. Why would anyone cook? So, okay, let me tell you how many grams this is. And then you need to sort of get 200 grams of this. Oh my God, I literally got, oh, I just spat apple in there. But I literally got 200 grams. Genius, what? Now I'm gonna put a bit of nutmeg in there. I think you are meant to do it at a different time, but you know what? Just do you. Now we're gonna mix these two, add some olive oil, salt, and maybe cheese. And then we're gonna add the potato. Imagine if this comes out well, imagine. Salt to taste, bang, olive oil. Now look, cause I'm more professional than a lot of you watching at home, I'm just gonna go with how I feel, but for you it's two tablespoons. And I can electively put cheese in. <laughs> cheese is never elective, it's essential. I've been given pastry corns and you, this is gonna combine these two ingredients because you don't wanna overwork this. Now I want you to know that I don't know this, I just heard someone say it off camera and I'm just repeating it back to you. I think it actually is looking decent and I'm gonna blanch it in that hot water there. <laughs> okay, so you wanna roll it into a thin penis and then one thin penis sitting on a bench, one thin penis looking at your friend. Cut that penis into pieces, cut that penis down, cut that penis down and put it in the water. I'm gonna blanch these off. And the way you know if they're cooked is that they will rise to the surface. So we've made the gnocchi, some of us have nailed it, and now we're going to try the carbonara, which always turns into scrambled eggs. And to be honest with you, I wouldn't be that pissed because I quite like scrambled eggs. This is pancetta. If it had been me, I would have just done a Coles sort of number. Okay, this is getting quite hot over here. Put that butter in there. Oh shit, that's connected. Pancetta, keep wanting to call it panna cotta, in there. Normally you'd put um, garlic in here, but the guy who did the shop forgot the garlic. So we're gonna cook this so it's nice and crispy. I reckon I could legit do this, do you know what I mean? Like if I didn't have to cook, I reckon I'd be really good at this show. Okay, then three eggs, cracked pepper. I like a lot, just do that to taste. Then cream, whiskey, McWhisk. Okay, here we go, let's play a game called Will it scramble? Come on, Tanya, you need this. Come on. It's scrambled, everyone. It has scrambled. Guys, this went downhill real quick. Okay. Oh, God. Okay. Now I'm going to put the gnocchi in the pan. Ah. Well, doesn't that look delicious? You know what? Maybe it looks rank, but tastes unbelievable. Let's plate it up. It actually looks good because of the way you plated it up. Thank you so much. I think I have like some sort of a gift. Um, Texture looks amazing. It's like, it's like gnocchi for breakfast. Oh my God, it's breakfast gnocchi. Oh. Is it rank? Yeah. It's rank? No, it's delicious. Let me, give, let me give it a go. No, I like it. I actually think it's better. I don't like- Have I invented breakfast gnocchi? Brocky. Breakfast gnocchi. It's unbelievable. Whoa. 